could soon look very different if Elon Musk follows through on a suggestion that he's made over Twitter. Haley Wooden with Business in Vancouver is joining us now and he's talking about taking the company private. Why would he want to do this? Tesla has faced a fairly high level of scrutiny. There's a lot of pressure on the company to be profitable as it brings electric vehicles to the mass market. And Tesla's also missed time and again many production deadlines. So Musk says this would really allow the company to operate freely and be its best self. Now, no clear idea yet whether this will actually happen. But if it does, Musk also said that current investors would have the option of going with Tesla as it goes private, which would actually be a very, very rare opportunity for retail investors to own a small piece of a Silicon Valley company that's private. So an interesting development to watch. It really is. You always hear about companies going public, so they're going a little bit the <laughs> other way right now. Yeah. Um, also, we're hearing about WestJet. They're putting in some new flights, I understand. They are. They're going to be offering nonstop flights between Terrace, B.C. and Calgary. They already offer nonstop flights between Terrace and Vancouver. But starting September 4th, two flights a week will be offered between those two new destinations, which actually means WestJet is now the airline carrier with the most nonstop flights out of Calgary, which is its headquarters. That number's at about 63 come September. And they also had one of their busiest days of the year. The company said yesterday, August 7th, it beat a new record. It flew about 80,200 passengers, which is uh, the most passengers ever flown in its history. So increasingly busy times for mm -hmm. WestJet. Lots of summer travel. Haley, thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you.